Hi guys, my name's Barb, and I'm new to the YouTube game. Hello guys, welcome back to my channel. Is it too early for Halloween? According to the stores, it is not. So, I'm going to do... Halloween decoration. I wasn't going to do them for a while, but sorry about the camera. But I thought, you know what? Why not? I have some good ideas. Let's do it. So first to start out, I'm taking this piece of wood. It's leftover wood. I um, Not wood, but like a generic wood flooring. And I'm going to paint it black. You don't have to paint both sides. You can if you want. I'm just going to pour it right on and just start painting it. And it'll probably only take one coat. So we're just going to go ahead and get this painted. You do want to get into the, you don't have to do the back, but you do want to get into the little grooves here. And all you have to do is go at the edge like that with a brush. It's easy to cover them in. Just make sure you do. If it has that kind of fold over ledge or edge, I'm sorry. And just make sure you get the sides really good. If you haven't subscribed to my channel yet, please subscribe. You just hit that red button. And if you hit the bell next to it, it'll let you know whenever I upload a new video, make a new video. So that really helps my channel. Also, if you give me a thumbs up and leave me a comment, it gives me a little more recognition on YouTube. And I would appreciate it. So we're just getting this finished. After we get it all painted, making sure we get the sides really good then we have to let it dry really well so i have this black piece of wood painted i don't know if the video is going to show i don't know what happened to it but i just painted a piece of black a uh, piece of leftover flooring and i painted it black and i printed out some stuff on my silhouette to put on and if you don't have a silhouette, you can always use the stickers from the Dollar Tree and you can paint them. And this is what the stickers look like from the Dollar Tree. These are just a few of them, different letters. And you can paint them any color you want. But I wanted to use my silhouette because I haven't been using it very much. So I'm going to go ahead and get my letters put on here. And then we'll go from there. Now I have my lettering on. And it says it's just a bunch of Hocus Pocus. And I picked up this um, decoration banner from the Dollar Tree. I'm going to put some decoration on it. Not sure what I'm going to use yet. Sorry about the noise. As you know, it's no editing here. But I'm going to use the legs and the broom. So I'm just going to cut that off of the string. These are the legs and the broom. I'm going to take some popsicle sticks. That way I can put them on the back. Of I'm going to put the feet at the bottom. The broom at the side. I may just put it on the top. Not sure yet. And then the hat at the top. We're going to use the popsicle sticks to give the hat a little support. I'm going to turn this over so I can get a good look at how I want my feet. 
I think right there would be a good place to just going to hot glue it right there. I am going to take a popsicle stick and place over it for support. And then for my sign, or my broom, I think it's just going to be right like that. Maybe like that. That would look better. <clears throat> and I'm just going to pop some hot glue on the back. And there is that so far. Next, we'll put the hat on the top. First, I think I need to put a hanger on it before I get the, um, the hat on it. Because I'll have to cover it up. So, I just make a little knot. Put a bunch of hot glue. Like, we'll eyeball it right in the middle here. A lot of hot glue. Press it down, real good. And I'm just gonna use a piece of a popsicle stick over it to give it more support. And there's a little hanger so far. So, next we are going to put the hat on. So, Turn it over and we will put the, it's both two sides so it doesn't matter. And this is only one side color so we'll get, if we're going to put it on we'll put it on like that. But I think I'm going to use the front. I'm going to take some jute first and put around the top of my broom here because it um, has this hole. Sorry, I was taking forever because I couldn't find my jute. So I'm going to take the jute and just start wrapping it around the top of the broom just to cover the holes. So I'm um, thinking about taking some of this tool or ribbon that I got from Dollar Tree and bunching it up around the corners or the edges of this. Kind of, let me pop this off. Kind of like a wreath. So I'm going to start. By just making a little poof right here. Take some pipe cleaner and put at the end. Twist it really tight. And make this little poof, that's all I can think of to call it, and put it at the edge. We'll cut this ribbon and put this at the edge right here. Let's see what it looks like. I think that would look good. And do that all the way around the edges. So that's what I'll do with this. I decided to take my pieces of tool, cut them into, I don't know, 10 inches sections. And then I'm going to just pull them down into these little puffs. And then take my pipe cleaner and stretch it around real tight get real tight and then um, I'm gonna make a bunch of these 
Then I'm going to go around and hot glue them onto the sides of the board. So that seems more sensible. Finishing up around the bottom of this. It's looking nice, actually. And kind of mimics a wreath. So I'm just going to go ahead and put the rest of these at the bottom. I've got the top and sides done. Oops, be careful, I'll rip the feet off. So um, I took those legs off because we're going to put this witch's hat on. And these were on the uh, hanging with it. So we're just going to use these legs because they look so much better. So we're just going to cut the ribbon off these and put them on the back of this. So I still need to use a popsicle stick to hold it on um, because they're not paper. What I'm going to do is put some hot glue on the top of the witch's feet and put the popsicle stick right there in the middle. Then I'm going to take and put some more extra glue on the popsicle stick and put it where I want my feet to be. Right there. I'm also going to take a piece of a popsicle stick and put it at the base right over top of this to give it some support right here. And also I'm going to put a popsicle stick across it like this. There's a piece left on it from the other one I had, so that'll give it a little bit of uh, support too. And then with the witch's hat, I'm going to do the same thing with the popsicle stick and hot glue it. Hot glue the um, popsicle stick onto the hat. Um, yeah. Go ahead and hot glue it on like that. And we're going to have to cut some of it off because we'll decide where we want it to go and just pop it right on there. You need to be careful. So let's see. Put it on like that. And slip it right down in there. Get all perfect. Just put it right on there. Now done, but I'm thinking about this, maybe needs a little editing to it, so we're going to take these, okay, make sure the popsicle sticks nice and glued. up around and there we go it's just a bunch of hocus pocus I think that is so cute and you can kind of fix the ruffles as you like them go around pull off the glue pieces and 
there's that. I hope you liked this video. If you did, give me a thumbs up. And don't forget to subscribe. And I'll see you on the next one.